In order to do this, you stand behind the person and make a fist with your thumb pointing back against you. Midline between the belly button and the rib cage. Grasp that fist with your other hand and pull back and up quickly until the object is expelled or the person loses consciousness and needs to be lowered to the ground to begin CPR. Six. It made two big changes. First, it removed Heimlich from the name Heimlich Maneuver and relabeled the method as abdominal thrusts. Second, it changed its protocols so that the recommended way to save a choking victim's life is now a two-step process. Step one, administer five blows to the back by hitting the palm of your hand against the area between the shoulder blades. If step one does not fix the problem, move on to step two. Perform five abdominal thrusts by first placing your fist around someone's stomach with your thumb against the middle of the abdomen, above the navel. Then, wrap your other hand around the fist and thrust upward. If the food is still stuck, repeat the process starting with step one. If the victim falls unconscious, start performing chest compressions with rescue breaths. First, lift the chin and tilt the head to open the airway. Pinch the nose shut. Make a complete seal over the person's mouth and blow air for about one second. Perform 30 chest compressions, pushing hard and fast in the middle of the chest. Look for and remove objects in the airway. If breaths don't make the chest rise, repeat the process. You should also consider calling 911 and do so immediately if the person passes out from lack of oxygen. Time is of the essence. Act fast and you may just save a life.